Welcome back to the Elder Scrolls Online, the Necrome expansion. I'm JDZ Gaming Empire, and I don't know if you notice or not, but um, our costume is a little different. Yes, I put a new costume on us. And which one is it? Let me see if I can remember. It's under collections. Uh, the Dark Passion Regalia. So I put that on myself and I also put it on um, Sharp as Night there so we could be matchy matchy. Okay, let's see. What are we getting ready to do? We are going to find the Infinite Panopticon. Uh, let's do that. And it is... Okay, we're right here. It is right over here. Right, let's call our trusty mount. Yeah. And just sleeping away. We just rolled right by him. See how long that gets us. They're gonna attack us, but we're gonna keep we're gonna keep going. Oh, okay, we're not gonna keep going. Okay, you want some? Sharp as night, why are you not? Attacking. Why are you just standing there, dude? I ought to get you just because. Okay, no, you're not an enemy. Now, let's continue. Okay, we got some more here. Nope, nope, nope. Get off the horse or the mount. Let's go. Okay. An armored Dremican. Let's see if we can just move scooty scoot on by. Okay, if you say so. You didn't have my back earlier. You're just standing there and let me do all the fighting. What? Where you come from? Over so soon. Uh, where are we going? Up. Okay, around this way. It's a uh, pier. Okay, we're here. As I feared, the entrance to the infinite panopticon has moved. As is its nature, which means we have failed and reality is doomed. I refuse this outcome. Fate, bend to my will. Laramel, be careful. There is no time. The Panopticon must exist. Here, I command it. Laramie, you did it. The Panopticon is open. Yeah, but look at her. That took a lot. What now? 
I guess we just need to go through it. Enter the infinite panopticon. Okay. We still have a little bit of time on our increased um, stats and our experience from the looks of it. Uh, let's see. Oh no. Hour and a half oh, and 22 minutes. Her presence is destroying the panopticon. Laramel, look at yourself. You're in no shape to continue. Okay. Nonsense. I... Mm. No. You are right. Proxy, you must deal with Vermina. I'm Did sorry. Help me to <laughs> to all right, all right. You can't all right. face Vermina alone. I don't believe I'm saying this, but I'll go with you. This is more than just the presence of a rival Daedric prince. Something else is happening here. Okay, can I look at my inventory now? <laughs> I was trying to see if I had. Oh, I don't see anything that's going to increase all three stats. Guess the best we're gonna get maybe the chicken breast. That's immediate. Uh, this is fifty-eight forty-seven. I don't seem to be running out of stamina <clears throat> or magicka. Okay, roasted venison sixty-five seventeen. Okay, that's more. I'm going to have to remember to put that on uh, when that expires in about 20 minutes. All right. What do we need to do here? Explore the infinite panopticon. What are we looking for? Let's get ready here. Corrupted lurker. All right. Presence is somehow intensified. Feel the power and face. of agony from below we need to go down mortal okay we need to go down here mortal let a pocket but you might wasn't that amazing We got the tornado books here. Hopefully it stays on that side of the platform. Okay, good. Oh, he went down pretty easy. Over so soon. Follow the books. Follow the books. The tornado books. Thank you. So there's a little bit of a delay when I call on her ability. It doesn't exactly happen immediately. Come back here. Satisfying snack. 
If we survive, the Great Eye will probably make me clean it up. <laughs> okay. Antiquity lead acquired. Okay. On that. Wasn't that amazing? Let's use our ultimate here. Remember, Vermina's not alone. Blight Crown and Torvisard are with her. Ramina's not alone. Blight Crown and Torvastard are with her. What? Oh man, that caused us some damage. Okay. Who's this fighting? happening in here oh there's a lot of enemies all right let's take care of the little dudes first we can I am a vessel of the great eye call on me okay see a frog jumping around let's see if we can't slip around this way maybe Not no slipping around. Okay, that one bad actually. Hidden kindred. Hmm. Looks like Vermina brought an army. Wow, this is a lot of enemies in here. Those, those dudes aren't paying no attention, so fine with me. I don't. Okay. Well, go ahead and smite. Smite away. Oh, I took care of him already. Let's see. What quest number are we on? Six of nine. This place feels ancient. 
Like no one's been here in an eternity. Right and concoction works splendidly. We are hidden, and Mora suffers. Tovasard, take the Dream Prince into the Eye of Mora, and find your memory. I have a final gift to deliver to the very core of Apocrypha. Blight Crown! Did he say something about an Eye of Mora? Yes. Ignore Blight Crown. We need to reach Vermina and destroy Shalreni's body. Okay, we need to get above, right. I guess up where they were talking. I see the Eye of Mora above us. That's where we need to go, mortal. Okay, right up there. Oh, get out of there. Go this way. I think so. This one's mine. Mortal, let me aid you. Feel the power of space! Ooh, we gotta level up. Nice. Well, let's, um... Didn't think you could get any stronger. Get to an area of safety first. Maybe right here. Oh, we get two weapons now. Hmm. Prophet's Inferno Staff. It's level nine. What? Uh. Oh no, I have a level nine equipped. Okay. We probably ought to take that. That's level 15. Yep, that's what we're taking. Okay, and Magicka. Oh, we get two skill points. Unblinking Eye. I think that was supposed to be morphed into something. We want to morph that in Unblinking Eye. The Languid Eye. Tear open the fabric of the Herberus to summon a scion of Hermaeus Mora. Um, okay, that's the standard. The new effect also applies a snare to enemies hit and damage increases over time. Let's get that. Okay. We can now swap. Nice. Okay. Now I have to figure out what I want to put on the back bar and what I want to put on the front bar. Abyssal impact. Use your arm with abysmal magic to form tentacles that lash out at your foes, dealing 4268 physical damage. Enemies are immobilized for 3 seconds and marked with abyssal ink for 17 seconds. Maybe I'll get this, put it over here, put this right here. Okay, and now I need to go to inventory. Let's put let's put this one right here, and let's see. That's a lightning, ten sixty. This one right here. And 60, 1108. Okay. So 
now when I swap, here we go. I think we're ready now. Um, I'm a guessing that we need to avoid this eyeball. Oh, great. We got the eyeball that's next to the corrupted seeker. Let's see if we can pull the seeker over this way. Can we get around that eye? There we go. Are we still going in the right direction here? this new skill, see how it does. I feel like we're going in a big circle. That takes us to nowhere. About over here. Okay, yeah, this takes us up. It looks like it takes us up. Okay, we got a, a lurker here. Let's build up some crux. sloppy, but we survived. Alright, let's try that ability again. Never a dull moment. I am a vessel of the great eye. Call on me. Wasn't that amazing? Okay, let me read what the devil that thing does. Use your arm with abysmal magic to form tentacles that lash out at your foes. Okay. En enemies are immobilized for three seconds. Is this it? Up here? Looks like there's a something we need to go through right here. Through there, mortal. Hurry. Okay. Calm down. This doesn't look good. Not good at all. Those cultists are in our way. Dispatch them, mortal. Okay. Satisfying smack. Uh, 
Like Hopper. Better Any? luck next oh, time. More? Oh. More. Let me eat. Oh, that's cool, actually. Oh, he got smacked! Mortal, we need to talk. Okay. Let me collect the loots first. Now that I understand how that ability works, it's pretty cool. Okay, Scroot, what's White up? Crown's a threat, but Vermina's a prince. We should follow Vermina and Torvisard into the Eye of Mora. What's this? What's inside this eye, Scroot? I have no clue which memory of Hermaeus Mora this particular eye contains. But we should go in and do what we came here to do. Find Vermina and destroy Master Shelreni's body. Without the protection it provides, Mora should be able to pinpoint her. I thought you said you're no longer in contact with Hermaeus Mora. You're right. I don't hear the Great Eye. I think that has something to do with Vermina's presence. Blight Crown's corruption, and the right they completed to enter the realm. It's just a guess, but if we solve one problem, it should help. Okay. Now, mortal, step into the Eye of Mora. Oh, that is so flippin' cool. What happened to this memory? I don't know. It looks more like a dream. Or a nightmare. Another Daedric Prince memory? You take me to the nicest places. <laughs> this has to be Vermina's fault. Stupid Prince of Dreams. Wow. This oh! This memory is mine now, mortal. I have wrapped it in a dream of my own creation. We need to discuss this, mortal. Okay, okay. Listen carefully, mortal. Vermina's power is limited here. This isn't her realm. It's only due to the necromancy they used on Shelreni's body that she made it this far. She's placed a dream around us, but the true memory is still here. So how do we find the true memory? Vermina hasn't been in here very long. She didn't have time to craft a perfect dreamscape to hide within. Look for flaws in the illusion, the cracks in the facade. Is that Hermes Mora out there? What's he doing in here? We're inside one of the Great Eye's secret memories. That's just an echo of him, part of the memory. Like I said, Vermina's overlay of dream stuff is imperfect, and we can take advantage of that. Let's see if we can spot any flaws we can exploit. Maybe Melon's ghost sight can help? Good idea. If you can find the weak points, I can break them open and expose the true memory beneath. Of course, knowing what the Great Eye values, that will probably drive us insane. <laughs> Took me centuries to recover the last time that happened. All right, let's look around. Uh, once again, Meln to the rescue. When you get close to a flaw, use my ghost sight to spot it. Okay, so we need to break the flaws in the dream, and there are a total of five of them in this area. Stuck. Oh, <laughs> there we go. He got me. He, he rooted me. Um, okay, nothing here. You want to tie? Fine. My sense of flaw. Use my ghost sight to reveal it. Okay. Where am I? Okay. These are actually showing us where the other ones are located. So we're going to go up this way. Okay. I've done the unthinkable. Now... I must make sure it cannot be undone. How is part of the true memory? Find me more flaws to break mortal. Right up here. 
Are you coming over here? You are coming over here. Where's the next one at? Okay, down there. I shall divide the only remaining memory of the event. My memory. And hide it in three glyphics. This must be the memory of when Hermaeus Mora hid the secret the enemy seeks. Okay, looks like my stack bonus is gone. Yeah, I have the increased experience, but we need to put something on to boost our, our health. Ah, uh, consumable. I thought I said this roasted venison. Yeah, let's take that. I always find myself in a better mood after a meal. We gotta go. Looks like we gotta go down. Gotta go down. And over where that corrupted lurker is. The way it began. Secured inside the glyphic of hidden paths. Okay, so it's up there. Some talking. All right, we got to get by the tornado of books. Oh, that's so cool! Very cool. All right, down. There's a path this way. I hear somebody's... Is that Vermina's voice? Okay, wherever that lurker is, that's where we need to go. Uh, up here. Looks like there's one right here. Oh, that is. I love it. Love it. Next one is right across the way there. The arguments that followed, locked within the glyphic of lost memories. Let's 
Run, 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 run. Woo! I think we're gonna make it. See her. Protect the three glyphics. Go and enter the mythos. Okay. Enter the mythos. Where's the mythos? Down there? We need to get back down. Uh, what is... Okay, back the way we came, it looks like. We gotta go up. And I guess it doesn't matter which way we take, the left or the right. If we go that way, we have to deal with a corrupted lurker. Alright, let's um go this way. Nope, 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 no fighting. Mythos. And this is the mythos deep beneath the Icor Sea. Another memory or more of the same? it but it's doesn't always use it deep beneath the icor sea another memory or more of the same hunger Your phone. Get off me! Get off of me! Smack him! You missed it! Tentacle? There we go. Remember how Torvasard altered a memory and changed the past? The damage they can cause here is enormous. Not the right way. Maybe this way. Oh, 
Oh, wait a minute, we just came from here. <laughs> what the? Uh, okay. This is the core of Apocrypha. Remember how Torvasar had altered a memory and changed the past? The damage they can cause here is enormous. Am I getting twisted around? Okay, there we go. Um... Son of a biscuit. Hey, that almost took a lot of my stamina away. Uh, where are we going? Through here? Yeah, through here. I'm a vessel of the great arm. Call on me. That satisfying snack. Oh, we gotta go there? Asked you? to the side. Vermina. Oh. Okay. Stop, Vermina. Uh oh. Bring our weapon out. Oh wow, okay, this is a boss fight. Give him a fight. Oh, hello! Mezama the Lurker. Power 
how did I get switched to that? To that back bar. Oh, need to heal. Where's your ghost site? Oh, right here. Try my ghost site to attack with precision. It's taking a long time to kill this dude. You're almost dead, buddy. But dang, you have a lot of hit points. Gravy. I can't imagine what it's going to be like to fight the main boss. We must slip away while we can, Wow. What the hell? We were fleeing. But what of the Glyphic Vault? Elena will pay for the damage she has wrought on my realm. Ooh. Approach chosen. 
and hear my words. Okay, talk to Hermea Zamora. I shook off the worst effects of Vermina's corrupting presence, but not soon enough. The intruders have fled, but the vaults of the Glyphic. You must determine if the secret remains secure. You hid this dangerous secret in a Glyphic? Not just any Glyphic. One of three primordial Glyphics that in total contain the entirety of the memory. I made everyone forget. A memory that if restored will destroy reality. Enter the vault. Check on the Glyphic! What will I find in there? That which I cannot see. The corruption coursing through Apocrypha continues to weaken me. I must do everything I can to maintain a connection to my realm. Enter and examine the Glyphic. I give you permission to gaze upon this portion of the memory. Isn't that dangerous? It cannot be avoided. Fate's chosen must make sure the Glyphic is secure and the memory intact. We shall talk again when you are done. What should I do beyond that door? Examine the Glyphic of hidden paths. It will reveal its portion of the secret to you. Regrettably, there is no other way to determine if the Glyphic remains intact. But fate will survive a slight fraying of its fabric. It has to now go. Okay. Guess we're going in through here. Enter the vault. The calamity of fate. Examine the Glyphic and see how this all began, Chosen. Oh, hang on a minute. Let's see. That's still good as far as the enchantment. It's not low yet. Um, this stuff is still good. Probably need to do something to increase our stamina. Yeah, we don't have very many potions here. Uh, that's health, which is still good. All right, let's use this to increase our stamina. And that, that to increase our magicka. Okay, and this should be on our big slot. Yes, it is. 8369. Okay. Oh, I didn't think I had any of these crown fortifying mills. Did I overlook them? It says I have 11. Oh, it's right here. I just really overlooked it. Well, that's okay because. Oh, it only does one at a time? Okay, that's a lesson learned there. So I I can't take those three different ones. If I want to have both my or my health and my magic and my stamina increased, I have to use the crown fortifying meal. Which I didn't even see here. For two hours, let's Well that was a waste of um, some foods. No, put that back. Okay, now where is... Right here. Yeah, total waste. Okay, and we have our immediate health on our Big slot. All right, let's examine this. Why have you called us all together, Prince of Fate? 
We must deal with this problem, Dream Reaper. I have seen what happens if we do nothing. Already the threads of fate unravel. They have no regard for the chaos they can cause. Oh, wow. Oh, Taurus Ark. Yeah, that's it. What I needed to spark my memory. I will restore the rest, Lord of Secrets. I will restore it all. Taurus Ark. Only one of the Unseen could evade my sight here. Chosen. We must speak. Okay. My power remains diminished due to the toxins Periot's followers polluted Apocrypha with. But you helped me break free of the worst of the miasma. You saw the contents of the glyphic of hidden paths. As did Torvisard. I did not expect that. That is not what he said. He said contents of the glyphic of hidden paths, not lost memories. Does that mean reality is doomed? Not yet. One thread in the tapestry snapped, but two more remain. If you can keep my enemies from unsealing the final two glyphics, there is still a chance to preserve Apocrypha and the rest of reality. You saw how this began the great omission you called torvisard one of the unseen what does that mean just something from very long ago something i did not expect to encounter ever again it is not important not yet right now fate requires a champion mortal what do you need me to do do as you have done Follow your heart. Return to Laramil. Consult with her. Defeat those who oppose us. You will know the best course of action when fate requires it. Now, I must conserve my strength. Apocrypha is under attack and I feel its pain. Oh, okay. Leave this memory, mortal. Take the portal. And return to your allies in Cypher's Midden. Hey. We need to go get our allies. Um. Uh, which portal? Oh, over here. Tell this is getting close to the end when they start talking about go um we need to discuss this mortal get your allies what do we need to discuss Scrooge? it's not saying oh wait a minute wait 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 where are we supposed to be going is that not it uh, am I, like, completely lost here? No, this says this is it. Uh, let me double check that. That's the only portal to go through. Is it doing weird things again? I mean, this actually looks like a portal right here, but I guess we can't go through there. Oh! Now, that's weird. Is this the portal? Okay, that's the portal we just left. What's up with this portal? Okay. See, that's weird. Because it's like telling us to go that way, but we can go this way. So, 
the next time, just come straight to this portal there in front of Hermes Mora. It's kind of misleading. Oh wow, we're back here. Nice. Okay. Let's go talk to our friends. See what they have to say and then we'll probably end the ep this episode. Oh, she's in here. Okay. I have recovered, Proxy. Now tell me. What occurred after we parted ways in the infinite panopticon? We freed Hermes Mora from Vermina's dream, but Torastard recovered part of the memory. Part of the memory has been remembered, but reality has not unraveled. So we must still have time to make this right. Vermina and her allies continue to assault Apocrypha, but freeing Hermes Mora was a victory. Well done. This is for you, Proxy. Oh, thank you. She's giving us a skill point and some gold. Secret and forbidden knowledge. Something so terrible that Hermaeus Mora wiped the very memory of it from all existence. But now Tolvasard has plucked a thin sliver from the darkness, urging us to remember. Though it pains me, we cannot allow that. Hermaeus Mora sent me to check on the glyphic that held the first part of the memory. I saw it, too. You did? I am unsure how I feel about that. I want to ask you a thousand questions, but the corruption plaguing Apocrypha grows worse with every passing moment, and Vermina still roams free. I am torn as what to do. The rest of the forgotten memory is contained in two more glyphics. Hmm. An opportunity, perhaps. It shall take Vermina time to locate the remaining glyphics. That gives us a chance to end the corruption and restore Hermaeus Mora's power. Are you willing to hunt down Blightcrown while I try to locate Vermina? I'll help you find Blightcrown, Laramil. What started in the Panopticon has spread beyond into other parts of Apocrypha. Gadain and I have seen its effects here among the stacks. While you investigate the corruption in Cypher's Midden, I shall try to determine where to find Vermina. What do we know about this corruption? We know it is a vile combination of dream and disease, developed by Blightcrown from concepts provided by Vermina and Periat. Master Shelreni helped to perfect it, and her right increased its strength. It hides Vermina and weakens Hermaeus Mora. Does it do anything else? As we have seen, it drives the inhabitants of Apocrypha mad, and turns even allied Daedra violent. Scroot could sense the agony of the realm back on Nairn. Here, I fear she may eventually succumb as the other natives have. Even I am not immune. You think I'm in danger? No. Despite your status as Fate's proxy, you seem resistant. Now, explore Cypher's Midden and try to track down Blightcrown or determine how the affliction spreads. I shall attempt to locate Vermina. Remember... They used sensors in the Panopticon. Okay. I'll go with you. It's not like I have anywhere else to be. Yeah, you're in my pocket. <laughs> right? <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay. Uh, that's not the right quest. Here we go. Investigate Cypher's Midden. And where is that at? Um, I guess it's... Not showing us till we get out of the building. Oh, it's right around here. Oh, there's one right there. Let's go ahead and take care of that before we end this episode. Let's find Why these has three. The realm turned against us. Apocrypha reels in pain, and oh, I will not. The Seeker just the swooped in, gaze. struck him down, Hermes flew Mora off. They've us? never attacked the settlement before. Looks like there's one over here, yes. Oops. 
It rushed to attack and then just froze in place. I think it's sick. Hmm. Excuse me. Alright, where's the other one? Is it up above? I should be up above. Uh, it's not saying yet. Oh, there it is. I see it. One of Blight Crown's sensors. Let's return to Leramil's study and tell her what we found. Uh, her studies up that way. Friend, the corruption has gotten worse. See to Scroot while I do what I can for Laramil. Oh. Oh my, Scrooge. Um, you're not looking good, baby. What's wrong? Flee, mortal. The pain overwhelms me. Soon I won't be able to tell friend from foe. And my many beguiling eyes. Each blinks out and goes dark in turn. Soon I'll be totally blind. What can I do to help, Scrooge? I... I don't know. But the pain and the blindness... Is this what caused the Great Eye to disconnect from his realm? To allow Vermina's dream to envelop him in order to escape the suffering? You don't suppose she has a dream for me, do you? If Dan's a monk, maybe he'll come up with something. The other mortal? Oh, to have my fate rest in such fragile hands. Really, you should go. Apocrypha is no longer safe, and I don't want to hurt you. Wait. A barely perceptible ripple in the threads. Someone approaches. Who's coming, Scrooge? Your allies suffer needlessly, oh. mortal. Allow me to aid them. This affliction is beyond my skills, friend. See what the Dramora has to offer. Where is... It? Oh, he's back there. Um, what's up, Torosar? Vermina and Periite have gone too far with their corruption. It works its way into the very fabric of Apocrypha. You only need to look to your two allies to see the harm it causes. I can ease their suffering, mortal. You've been working with Vermina and Periite the whole time. Why should I trust anything you say? It was an alliance of necessity. I needed their assistance to recover that which was taken from us in ancient times. Hermaeus Mora did what he thought right, as have I. I have no desire to punish him for following his nature. So what exactly are you offering? I know where to find Blightcrown, so that you can stop him before he does irreparable damage to this realm. And I can show you where Vermina has gone. I no longer care to share the ancient memory with her or Periite. Why would you help me after all this? Because I also require help. I offer a trade, an end to this assault on Apocrypha for the assistance of fates chosen. Decide, mortal. Blight Crown even now works his way toward the core of this realm. Soon it will be too late to reverse the damage. All right, tell me where to find Blight Crown. I will mark a location on your map. Here we can open a path to the place Hermaeus Mora calls the Mythos. Not to a memory this time, but to the here and now. Then you can stop Blight Crown before the corruption becomes irreversible. What do you mean, open a path? It will take all of us to reach the mythos. Allow me to ease the suffering of your allies. Oh, I can see again. Oh, oh good. Proxy. Screw. I shall join you at the location. Okay. Rendezvous with Laramel and Torvis. Torvisard. All right. Well, we will do that. Let's get out of here. It's a little crowded. In the next episode because this one's gone a little long well, we are definitely near the end uh, where are we rendezvousing over here yeah it looks like right there okay 
I tell you what, what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to go back to Necrom and upgrade my mount. And when we come back, I will probably be at, I might be at the rendezvous point already. Just so you guys don't have to see me riding over there. But anyways, I'm going to end this episode right here. Thank you so very much for watching. I hope you are enjoying this playthrough of the Elder Scrolls Online Necrome expansion. And if you are, I appreciate you giving this video a um, thumbs up and subscribing. I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.